mourning one of their own. Former Health Minister Joseph Kalete was laid to rest according to Muslim traditions on Friday. Witnesses said he died from machete wounds after his car was attacked by Christian fighters. He wasn't even holding any function with the Seleka. He was excluded by the Seleka. But as a Muslim official, the cowardly killed him because of that. This as heavy gunfire erupted in Bangui on Friday. Anti-Balaka militias began attacking and looting shops in the predominantly Muslim neighborhood of Miskine on Friday, prompting retaliation from Seleka fighters. Rwandan peacekeepers backed by French forces came in to try and restore the peace. Since this morning, there has really been no security, no peace. We're all just standing here. I don't know what to do. There's no money, there's no action being taken, and everything is messed up. Amnesty International says more than 50 Muslims have been killed in two attacks in January in villages northwest of Bangui. Thousands of French and African peacekeepers have been trying to calm a political crisis that has ignited tit-for-tat killings by armed Christian and Muslim movements. New interim president Catherine Samba Panza is expected to appoint a new government in the coming days. Carol Oyola, CCTV.